All right, guys, let's make a neon jellyfish. What's it gonna look like? And... Are you buying Robux or Regina gift cards soon? Well, use code MEGANPLAYS while doing so to help support the channel. Hey, what is up, you guys? It's Megan. Welcome back to my channel, Peachy Squad. As we now know, the winter update is gone, and we have gotten some new Aussie pets and a new jellyfish. New year, new pets. Let's take a trip down under. Three new Aussie pets and easy rewards. Jellyfish. Yay! Adopt Me Admin gave you these, these, and these. The first thing I want to do is tell you guys how to get the jellyfish because a lot of people don't don't know um which is totally fine and totally understandable but every time there's a ugc pet people are always like how do you get that um and so i am here to answer that question as we can see we got some full grown pets so we are going to be making some neons oh my gosh they gave me four neons oh my gosh four neons of these too okay so we got four tasmanian devil neons we got four cucas cucuco cucas <laughs> and then four kookaburras um just fully grown so we're gonna be making some neons today but first and foremost i want to show you guys how to get the jellyfish oh and also i almost forgot guys comment down below your login day streak today mine is 41 just 10 times lower than my longest day streak but what, what are you gonna do so if you want to get the new ugc pet the first thing you want to do is go to the accessory area you can get there quickly by going to petware and get more accessories then you're going to walk all the way to this little hidden spot back here and you are going to start your UGC reward by an official adopt me avatar UGC accessory which you can wear across the experiences on Roblox e earn a stamp for each accessory you buy and redeem the reward so as we can see we can see our little stamps we have to buy UGC so this one is 59 it doesn't matter oh okay just refreshed it doesn't matter if you buy the same of any of them, you don't need unique ones. I think Adami is really just trying to farm UGC buys. So another one that's 59. So if we do like 60 of these, that's like 120 plus 120 is 240. So it's basically like a $240 Robux pet. Oh, I already own this item. What happens if I own all the items? Heart hat, I guess we'll get this one. I hope that they have enough for me to go ahead and succeed. Hard hat, okay buy this one awesome okay um let's see and we need one more guys this little bunny spring bunny nose will do just fine and bing bang boom there we go we have gotten ourselves a jellyfish yay oh hello so, so cute <laughs> okay what what's it look like when we pick it up okay that's cute look it's got its little eyes it's little happy little happy eyes absolutely adore it so i hope that was helpful for those of you who don't know how to get the ugc pets you can do that as many times as you want i guess pertaining to like which ugc you own and you don't own um i guess that's completely up to you it's nighttime. I know it's not optimal to check out this new update, but we're gonna do it anyway. So we have 13 days to collect these pets. Uh, Kuka for 750 bucks. We have the Kookaburra for 150 Robux, and then the Tasmanian Devil for 1450 bucks. I think that's as much as a royal egg. I'm not sure though. Um, and if we take a look at the jellyfish, they're ultra rare. The kookaburra is an ultra rare. The Tasmanian devils are rare. And the kuka is a uncommon. So we can get nice little close-ups of the pet. Look at them. They'll be following you around. They'll be doing cute things. Oh my gosh, adorable. If you guys didn't see one of my last videos, my last news videos, it was titled like, is it on me bringing back the Aussie egg or something like that. Um, I checked out the pets in real life, so if you want to see that, you can go there. Oh, oh no. <laughs> this jellyfish is not feeling too well. That's okay. Let's go make some neons because I know we're all super curious as to what these pets look like in their neon forums. Okay, here we are. Which one should we do first? I think we could start with the cuca. Now, let's guess what color the cuca neon is. I'm going to guess blue. Green! Okay, still adorable, still cute. Oh, so cute, it's so cute. Okay, let's make a mega neon. So equip, place, equip, place, equip, place. And, hey, oh, here he is. Oh, ah! oh he fell to the ground. <laughs> cute, so cute. Oh my gosh, adorable. And then what do we get? Oh yes, ooh, yay. 
I just got some, what are these RGB boxes? How exciting. All right, what is going to be next? Let's take a look at the Tasmanian Devil. This one is like an orange, pink, red. I think it's red. I think this is classified as red, um, which makes sense, you know, Tasmanian Devils. It could be a little bit like, you know, if you saw the video where I looked at them in real life, they're kind of scary. They're kind of a little bit creepy. Okay, and place. Now the reveal. Boom! Oh my gosh. Hi, Tasmanian Devil. So cute. <gasps> He's glowing. Oh my gosh. Cute, adorable, fun. I'm smelling the back of his head and it smells like fleas, but what are you gonna do about it? And then let's take a look at the kookaburra. As we can see, um, I, I think the obvious choice here is that his beak is gonna be glowing blue. That's what I think it's gonna be. I think it's gonna be glowing blue. Um, of course, we're not making a mega neon, we're just making a neon, um, but th that's the T and bing, bang, boom, and boom, the kookaburra. Oh, it's pink. <gasps> oh my God, cute. And it's like different variations of like purple, pink, and then light pink. Okay, okay, adopt me. I can see, you know, maybe my critique, you know, this is, this is a well thought out pet. That's so cute. That looks so good. That looks so good. Okay, heck yeah. And guys, the moment we've been waiting for, let's place in these jellyfish. So we'll place one, two, three. All right, guys, let's make a neon jellyfish. What's it gonna look like? And, whoa! Okay, okay, he's red. <laughs> I wanted pink. I wanted pink, but what are you gonna do? Let's kind of move over here and then we can see a little bit better. Oh, fun. Okay, guys, so which one is your favorite? Do you like the neon jellyfish or do you like the mega neons of these other pets? What are you guys feeling? What is the vibe? And here's what they all look like in the daytime. The jellyfish, it's kind of orange. She's definitely glowing. The kookaburra in the daytime, cute. The Tasmanian devil, scary, but I love the mega neon version. Um, and then the kuka, so cute. I love this pet, it might be my favorite. <laughs> it's like a little hamster. Wait, how come we don't have a pack of adopt me pets like labeled like um, domestic small animals and it's like, it's like ferrets and <laughs> hamsters and bunny rabbits and um, guinea pigs. Hmm? Hmm? That's a good idea, Adopt Me. Don't worry, I'll be submitting it and then if it comes out, I will take credit for it. Why not? Comment down below which is your favorite. Thank you guys so much for watching today's update video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe button, and leave a comment down below, Peachy Squad. Until next time, don't forget to hashtag stay peachy, stay kind, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!